For the first time in nine months of war, aid workers will this week run out of food for millions of people going hungry in Ethiopia's Tigray region. That's according to Samantha Power, head of the United States humanitarian agency USAID. In a statement late on Thursday, Power said USAID, its partners and other humanitarian organizations had depleted their stores of food warehoused in Tigray. She added that people in Tigray are starving, with 900,000 in famine conditions and more than 5 million in desperate need of humanitarian assistance. Earlier on Thursday, UN Secretary General Antonio Guterres pushed for an immediate ceasefire in Tigray. Humanitarian conditions are hellish. Where the federal military is fighting forces aligned with the Tigray People's Liberation Front. And we have heard first-hand accounts of women who have been subjected to unspeakable violence. And the spread of the conflict has ensnared even more people in its horror. It is time for all parties to recognize that there is no military solution. And it's vital to preserve the unity and stability of Ethiopia, which is critical to the region and beyond. The conflict has killed thousands and sparked a humanitarian crisis in one of the world's poorest regions. In recent weeks, it has spread to the neighbouring Afar and Amhara provinces, displacing around 250,000 people and raising concerns of a wider destabilisation of Africa's second most populous country.